Sir Malcolm Campbell needs no introduction. His courage and skill have made his fame worldwide. Like other famous racing drivers, he knows that skill alone is not sufficient on the racetrack. The driving rules must be strictly observed if accidents are to be avoided. He knows too that care and observance of driving rules can prevent the tragedies of our road. It was care and in addition to his other qualities that enabled him to do 270 miles an hour. Now hear what Sir Malcolm has to say about some of the driving faults he has noticed on our highways. Some people are always in a hurry. They blind over crossings as though they are the sole occupants of the road. They forget that such driving is dangerous to others as well as themselves. Surely it's much better to stop at the crossing, take a good look both ways, and proceed only when the road is clear. Here's another chap in a hurry. Did you ever see this madness? Trying to pass on a narrow bridge and without being able to see what is approaching. Then there's the driver who accelerates downhill. He couldn't possibly pull up if there was a sudden obstruction. Why not take it slowly and let your engine be a brake instead of a power? It's safer and more comfortable. Selfish people often stop their cars opposite to each other, completely block the road and nearly cause a crash. Now meet the thoughtless driver who not only parks on a bend but alights without looking. Absolutely asking for trouble. Impatience is a bad fault. Why try to save seconds at the expense of lives? If you are held up by traffic lights, you must wait for the green. Not start on the amber light and endanger the cross traffic. The course of true love will never run smoothly if, when you see your best girl, you pull up suddenly to have a chat with her. At best it means discomfort to following traffic. At worst a crash. These two will certainly have a rough course one day. The worst of all offenders is the road hog who cuts in and endangers at least three vehicles. Time is not everything on the road, but safety is. It's safety first and safety all the time. 